worked. Good. Um, right, this session uh, is called The Social Determinants of Health and Health Equity in Cities. Uh, we've had two days of presentations which I think have made clear not only that there are often wide health disparities within cities, but that the movement of people into them, into the cities that is, creates a continuing challenge for those who are running the cities. Uh, moreover, some of the attributes of health, particularly well-being and happiness, are contested and or hard to measure. Having said that, I think we've also established that cities can make a difference. That is, the way the cities are planned, housing, public health policies, for example, smoking bans and what the way um, road, uh, those who use roads are policed, and, of course, encouraging walking, exercise, and sport and environmental policy are all ways in which cities can affect the health of their uh, citizens. We're going to hear more about that, and particularly uh, how far cities can go towards encouraging other organizations to give those who live in cities a better chance. And to that end, our first speaker in this session is uh, Sharon Friel, who is Professor of Health Equity at the Australian National University in Canberra. Sharon. 